This is uh, we're from the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter Day Saints, um, and this is kind of what we believe um, God's plan for each one of His children. And we just we wanted to make a big mural of it and talk to people about it. So you came to East Lansing today. Are you from East Lansing? No, we're actually I'm from Utah. Oh wow. He's from and Utah. I'm. I'm from Minnesota. So. so part of being a member of the Mormon church is that you do have to do missionary work, is that right? Correct. Um, it's a choice. Um, we can we can either do it if, if we want to. We kind of submit almost like an application. So, you know, it's from our own free will. We uh, They don't force it upon us or anything like that. So it's our choice. So how are you supporting yourself as you go across the country doing this? We saved up money beforehand. Kind of, kind of put our life on pause for a couple of years. We save up some money and then come out. So, how many places have you been so far? Um, we uh, just go around the just the state of Michigan. I've been in Marshall, uh, Saginaw, Holt, and East Lansing. How was your reception today in East Lansing? You were standing on Grand River, uh-huh. right across from campus, but the students aren't back. Uh-huh. Well, it's, <laughs> it's a it's a little cold, but. Uh, we got some pretty good reception. We were able to talk to quite a few people. I'd say at least 25 people. Um, what would you say? Yeah, it was it was really good. We got some good results from it. So, is there a church in this area that you can send people to? There is. It's off of uh, Saginaw Highway, um, between I think it's Hagedorn and Abbott Road. Now, in Michigan, one of the more famous uh, of the uh, Mormon families are the Romneys. Yep. Mm-hmm. Do right. people ask you about them, or do you use them as an example? Or uh, not. A lot of people do ask us about uh, the Romney family, but we don't. I mean, we tend we tend not to bring that up just because. I mean, it's not really part of you know what we're teaching. So. What do people ask you? What's with the white shirts and ties and name tags? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably pretty much that. Do you get into any theological discussions with either Catholics, Protestants, or atheists? Oh, yeah. Definitely, yeah, all definitely. the time. A few the Jewish time. people, maybe? We do. Yeah. yeah. All, all, all sorts. <laughs> so how many people do you feel you actually persuade? Any idea? Um, I don't know to say. We, like what we... Sh- the message that we share, uh, we know that's true. That's why we're we're out here. You can say, but uh, we in, we teach and we ask people to, or we invite people to to learn more. And you know, a lot of people are curious and want to want God in their life or whatnot. So, it sparks their interest. Are you in college? No. No. Uh, were you in college? Did you leave college to come do this, or? No, I was actually straight out of high school. I think. Uh, Elder Schuler, he had a year of college under his belt before he came out, but I was right out of high school. So was Elder Wecker. Okay. Yeah. You want to give me your names? My name's Elder Smith. Elder Smith? I'm uh, Elder Schuler. And you are? I'm sorry, I, I missed am that. Elder Wecker. Oh. Elder Wecker, W E C K E R? That's right. And Schuler is F C H? S C H U L E R. Okay. And when you call each other elders, you don't look too elder to me. That's <laughs> <laughs> so a title we go by. Ah. So is that something that the church awards you for service? Uh, or is that a, a, a just a mark of respect when you talk to each other? Just a mark of respect. Mm-hmm. What do you think is the biggest misconception people have about the Mormon church? Uh, well, a lot of things. <laughs> I mean, probably the biggest ones polygamy um you know we don't have been mormon church hasn't practiced that in over like 120 30 years so like i mean just that's a pretty big misconception so recruiting might be a lot easier if you still offered it (laughs) 